Hi guys, thanks for tuning in again to uh, Match Fishing TV UK. I'm Dan. Um, just off for a shortish session today, local lake about five minutes away from me. Um, gone as light as I can, I still want to have a bit of a practice. I've got the box, etc. It's not like a super light session where I might take uh, literally just a chair and a rod. Uh, Going to do a bit of method and pellet wag today. Lake's quite shallow. Um, gets up to about sort of three and a half, four feet at its deepest. Um, it's not a huge lake, so you don't need to have a massive cast. So I've got 10 foot uh, method feed rod with me and I've got an 11 foot pellet wag. Um, it's all dependent as well, because uh, the members only fishery and the weather's beautiful today on what peg I can get on, because a lot of the pegs are uh, covered with trees and uh, snaggy and you know there's a few times I've come down and I've ended up fishing a pole with sort of six meters clearance in the middle of a massive lily pad bed which is lovely stuff but don't have the pole with me today so fingers crossed I can get a, a nice open swim uh, to have a go and uh, join me back when I'm on the bank. So here I am, I've picked my peg. Um, I can see loads of carp uh, on the top at the moment. So like I say, I'm gonna go for a bit of a pellet wag approach, uh, a bit of a method feeder, probably no further than 30 meters out. See how we go. There's a bit of a ripple on the water at the moment, a bit of a breeze, so I'll probably start on the method. Um, hopefully if that calms down a bit later on, um, get the pellet waggler out and have a go from there. But it looks absolutely beautiful today. half an hour now, uh, getting loads of liners, um, nothing quite happening right now, so obviously loads of fish around the feed, um, knocking off uh, the ground back of the method feeder, so I've made a quick change, I've changed from a wafter uh, to a couple of bits of hair rigged sweet corn, uh, been soaked in sweet F1, so we'll see where we go, but I'm getting liners still, liners, liners, liners. See the fish out there, it's being very canny at the moment.
uh, two and a half hours in now. I've had, I reckon, 50 pounds, um, all in method. Run through the changes, the first half hour was a bit slow. Um, started off on an orange wafter, went on to corn for a little bit. I was getting loads of liners, just wasn't, wasn't quite happening. Uh, went on to a yellow wafter, um, moved a little bit closer actually, and then I've had a steady string of fish uh, since. There's loads of fish on the top at the moment. Um, so I've got about two hours left. Hopefully can uh, get close to that 100 pound mark. So uh, wish me luck.
Um, I'll quickly work you through what my setup is and it really couldn't be any simpler today. So what we've got is a 25 gram flatbed method feeder, a Drennan one. Um, it's the large size uh, through to a four inch, you can see it, uh, Guru method uh, hook length, uh, just fishing with a uh, eight mil band and wafter on the end. Uh, and that has caught consistently all day. I did try with uh, an orange one, had one fish with it, weren't so keen on that. I also tried corn uh, today, had a couple on that. The uh, problem is that corn doesn't stay on for that long, so as soon as I switched back to the yellows, um, they were on it, so obviously they wanted some corn today.
I'll just run you through the mix I've been using today as well. Um, it's been a really simple day. I've tried to keep it as simple as possible. So I've got some uh, two nil pellets that I've added to some special G ground bait. The first time I've used this, really, really impressed. Really fine, uh, goes in the method feeder really nicely. Um, it's lasted, I haven't had to top it up with too much moisture. Um, probably in a match would have put it for a riddle because I've got a few lumps there, but they're hungry today, so it hasn't really mattered. Uh, and then a bit of my old favorite, a bit of uh, F1 sweet, uh, dynamite bait swim stim. Um, I put that on my corn, I put a little bit of that in the ground bait. If I'm feeling so inclined, I could uh, put some on some pellets. I've had some hard pellets today, haven't needed them. So it's uh, it's been one of those days. Simple baits, simple rig, simple tactics. You know, two lines, fantastic. fishing that has been um, that could not have gotten any better uh, had one of those days where everything seemed to work um, had different plans worked out and they went really well actually running a bit late for a party now um, because I saw a big fat wobbly thing in the margins where I just chucked my bait so I couldn't have a couldn't resist really having to go for it but um, unfortunately didn't get that one so um, I've got to run now but thank you very much for watching um, and obviously as all YouTube people say if you like the video hit the subscribe button